folks, it's Bunny Love. Gabrielle Union gets fired from America's Got Talent and other celebrities speak out about this situation. Let's talk about it, guys. Okay, so here's what's been going on with Gabrielle Union ever since her departure from America's Got Talent. NBC may have fired Gabrielle Union from America's Got Talent, but it certainly hasn't silenced her or the many supporters coming to her defense. In the weeks since the network announced it would part ways with the actress who served on the season 14 judges panel for the long running reality show, scathing reports have surfaced detailing a toxic and racist backstage culture that Union allegedly endured and reported during production. Instead of heeding her concerns, producers allegedly rejected them and retaliated by terminating Union's contract. Now, NBC is answering for its alleged actions and sag after Time's Up and several outspoken celebrities continue to rally behind Union and demand justice. Here's a timeline of what went down from Union's termination to NBC's public non-apology. NBC fires Union. News of Union's exit first broke November 26th when Variety reported that NBC opted not to extend her and fellow celebrity judge Julian Hawk contract for a second season. The pair of women joined the competition program earlier this year, replacing longtime panelist Melanie Brown of Spice Girls fame and model Hailey Klum. The decision immediately raised eyebrows as Union and Hoff, male colleague, executive producer Simon Cowell, comedian Howie Mandel, and Brooklyn Nine-Nine star Terry Crews were reported to return, though the circumstances of the termination of Union and Hoff were still unclear. Initial skepticism turned to outrage when a new report from Variety revealed ahead of the holiday weekend that Union Split from America's Got Talent wasn't amicable, but forced after the Bring It On alum allegedly reported toxic and racist behavior during production. The most high-profile incident occurred when Jay Leno allegedly made a racist joke about Korean restaurants while taping a segment for the show, prompting Union, an outspoken advocate for minority communities, to file a complaint with producers who allegedly dismissed her but excluded the joke from the final cut. The network also reportedly discouraged Union from wearing a variety of hairstyles that it allegedly deemed too black for viewers. Oh my goodness. I can't believe what I'm reading here. While Union expressed concern that a white contestant overstepped while impersonating celebrities of color such as Beyonce. America's Got Talent has a long history of diversity in both our talent and the acts championed by the show. NBC and series production company Fremantle said in a joint statement at the time the details emerged. The judging and host lineup has been regularly refreshed over the years. And that is one of the reasons for AGT's enduring popularity. NBC and the producers take any issues on set seriously. Dwayne Wade weighs in. NBA superstar Dwayne Wade was among the first to stand up for Union on social media following her exit, praising his wife for staying true to herself and questioning why America's Got Talent would part ways with one of its most popular personalities. Over the past year, I've been approached by many people saying that my wife, Union, is the main reason they've started watching America's Got Talent or that they love her insight and sincerity on the show, he said in a series of tweets. Okay, so this next tweet here. So when I got the news that my wife was being fired, my first question was obviously why. I am still waiting on a good answer to that question. But if anyone knows it's Gabrielle Union or have heard of her, you know she's an advocate for our community and culture. Next set of tweets. As proud as I were of her being selected as a judge on America's Got Talent, I am even more proud of her for standing up for what she stands for, and that's us. 
Okay, so he's definitely standing by his woman. So that's a good thing. She's got really good support, excellent support system. More stars rally behind Gabriel Union. Dwayne Wade wasn't the only celebrity to come to Union's defense. Several stars, including Ellen Pompeo, Ariana Grande, Jamilia Jamil, and Patricia Arquette, slammed NBC for its alleged mistreatment of the L.A. finest actress. This is terrible, Arquette tweeted at Union. You should not be penalized for trying to have a workplace that honors the rule of law in the workplace. Pompeo called out unhealthy culture at the network and in TV as a whole. It's unfortunate that at NBC, the same network that protected disgusting men like Matt Lauer and punished women for speaking out or not putting up with it has not changed their practices or culture. The Grey's Anatomy star wrote, I support Union's commitment to speaking up to injustice. It takes courage. So Ariana Grande here just basically replied to Ellen's uh, tweet on Twitter and pretty much agreed with what she had to say about the situation. Gabriel Union definitely seems to have a very good and very, very supportive group of people that are willing to be by her side through this whole ordeal. It's always tough for some people when they lose their jobs. And some people probably would say, oh, well, she's a celebrity, whatever. We don't care. She'll be all right either way. Nobody knows what's really, truly going on with her. I mean, who knows? That could have been a job she really, truly wanted, and now it's gone. And just the whole emotional part of everything, it, it could be just getting to her emotionally. So I think that... Um, it's a little unfair to say, oh, well, she's the celebrity. She'll be okay. Still, she's still a human being at the end of the day. Nobody really truly knows how she's feeling about this. And um, it could really be bothering her. She's wearing a pretty brave face at this point, but it could really be bothering her. And I think that she's got a really good support system and that helps when it comes to things like that. Okay, so the next tweet that I have here for you guys, Jamila Jamil, I am lucky to work with really good people at NBC and am sad and angry to know that this has been going on in that same network. I stand with Gabrielle Union all the way. They should bring her back with a big raise and remove Simon Cowell instead. Oh, wow. She went in on Simon, huh? Well, I'm not surprised at that. Nobody likes Simon. Simon is... Not very many people's favorite person. <laughs> Moving on. While Union hasn't divulged any details about what happened, she took to Twitter shortly after to thank those speaking out on her behalf. And her tweet reads, So many tears, so much gratitude. Thank you. Just when you feel lost, adrift, alone, you got me up off the ground, humble and thankful forever. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty much what I had figured. I figured that just because she didn't show that she was upset about the fact that she lost her job doesn't mean that she wasn't upset about the fact that she lost her job. She just knows how to control her emotions. She knows how not to act a fool on camera, on national television, or on the internet for the whole wide world. She knows how to keep her emotions in check. So just because a person's able to control themselves as far as their emotions doesn't mean that things don't still bother them. I mean, we're human. Things are going to bother us, but we just have to know how to move forward and not react like fools and monkeys. <laughs> so yes, um, Gabrielle did what she was supposed to do. She um, reacted in a very calm, cool, collected type of a manner, which is great. Um, and I'm just really glad that she's got so much support. It makes a difference and she's going to be all right. I think she's going to be all right. She's going to be able to move on and there should be much bigger and better opportunities for Miss Gabrielle Union. So proud of her. So glad that she was able to do this and face the world with no negativity.
She did not come across negative. She came across very, very mature, and it was just really, really good to see. So, you guys, um, that's my time. I'm out of here. I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Just wanted to bring a little bit of information about Miss Gabriel Union and what was going on with her termination with America's Got Talent. Um, also, too, let me just say real quick before I wrap this video up, she should be glad, really, that she's off that show. I mean, I, I know it's probably easier said than done, but, you know, she should be glad because am I the only person that may have realized and if you guys have seen it too please drop this in comments and that's that america's got talent is a fake show anyway the people that come on the show that are talented they really are talented but the ones that bomb out and don't do any good i think all of that stuff is scripted i don't think it's it, it can't be there's been a lot of reviews on YouTube about how phony that show is. So hopefully Gabrielle Union is happy that she's not associated with such a fraudulent show anymore anyway. <laughs> all right, you guys, drop your comments. Let me know what's good and follow me on all social media. The end of this video will tell you just where to find me. Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube here. Of course, subscribe if you haven't already. And check me out once again for Celebrity Gossip Talk, Current News, and Reality Show Reviews. Peace and blessings, folks. Take care. Enjoy the rest of your day later on don't forget to add the underscore when adding me on instagram